up all in very small pieces. I'm gonna put them on a tray for pre-freezing and then get them in a freeze dryer. So that I'm gonna pre-freeze and then I can transfer to a freeze dry tray. Fresh, or a fresh pineapple that's been frozen. There's the pineapple chunks. Again, I did very small pieces. They dried really nice, nice and crunchy. Had a 12 hour freeze time and a 12 hour final freeze. Had a total of about 53 hours. A very long cycle. The pineapple dries slowly. I think it did better cutting it this way though. It was probably longer than it needed. It probably could have gotten it down to 45 hours or something. So the, the small pineapple chunks dried nicely. And you can see they crush up. Oh, it's delicious. I probably wouldn't bother rehydrating them. They'd just eat them this way, or maybe powder them, put them in milkshakes, ice cream, use them for cooking in different ways. But I probably wouldn't bother to rehydrate them. few minutes ago. All right. It does rehydrate quite well. Did you do enough for everybody? Uh, I will. I'm going to put a couple more in there. I should get a bigger container. Okay. Want to try one? Sure. Here comes the pineapple plane. Because it has the overall texture and stuff. Good. If you thought of it as warm pineapple, then it's not too terrible. It's quite good. It's excellent. It's wonderful. Well, that's pretty good actually. I'm kind of surprised. Okay, so they do rehydrate. Pretty soft, but probably give them a few hours it would be better. But in general, I think uh, don't bother to rehydrate it, just eat them dry because they're so good. Or use them in stuff.